Have you ever experienced that strange feeling of deja vu? Like you've lived this moment before, even though it's your first time experiencing it. This peculiar sensation, this eerie familiarity, is something we've all felt, yet its origins remain shrouded in mystery. Imagine if the explanation for this phenomenon lies not within the confines of our linear understanding of time, but instead in the ancient belief of time being cyclical. Picture a never-ending loop of existence where we relive the same lives over and over again. Consider this. Ancient civilizations believed we are currently in our fourth cycle of existence. The sense of familiarity, the deja vu you experience, could be echoes of your past lives resounding in your current one. Intriguing, isn't it? So let's delve deeper. What if I told you that this strange feeling might be connected to an intriguing theory about our universe? Stay with me as we embark on a journey beyond the ordinary and into the realm of the extraordinary. Welcome to the fascinating world of the Uniplanetary Evolution Theory. It's a theory that might make you question everything you've ever known about where we came from and where we are heading. Now, let's take a moment to ponder an intriguing proposition. What if each of the eight planets in our solar system is simply Earth, but at different stages of its evolution? Sounds like a science fiction novel, doesn't it? But bear with me and let's dive a little deeper. Consider the fiery world of Venus. According to this theory, Venus is Earth, just a billion years younger. It's a glimpse into our planet's past, a world in the throes of its early evolution. Now let's cast our eyes towards the red planet, Mars. In the grand tapestry of the uniplanetary evolution theory, Mars isn't just a barren desert, but Earth in the distant future, a billion years from now. It's a silent testament to the eventual fate of our planet. But how does this massive leap across time and space happen? The planets, you see, are slowly spiraling away from the Sun. As Earth moves out of the so-called Goldilocks zone, the perfect conditions for life, Venus is moving in. Each time our Earth is about to move out of this zone, we hop to the next planet and continue our evolution. If this is our fourth cycle, then we have evolved four billion years. This migration could explain the missing link, the billions of years of our human evolution, lost in the sands of time. So, imagine if we could travel to Venus. We could potentially escape Earth's Martian fate and journey a billion years into the past, long before the dawn of mankind. It's akin to stepping into a time machine, going back to the beginning and kick-starting life all over again at the beginning of our planet's habitable existence. So you see, each planet might just be a different version of our own Earth at various stages of its life cycle. Now, how does this relate to that eerie feeling of deja vu you've experienced, you might ask? Well, let's dive in and explore the fascinating interplay between the uniplanetary evolution theory and the phenomenon of deja vu. This theory intriguingly proposes that we are living the same life over and over again, but on different planets. Imagine that each one of our lives replayed on a different stage, but the same act in the grand performance of existence. But how does this explain deja vu? Remember those ancient cultures we discussed earlier? They believed in a cyclical nature of time. We find the symbol of the Ouroboros, a snake swallowing its tail, in ancient civilizations all around the world. It represents that time is cyclical and that the destruction of something marks the birth of something else for eternity. No beginning and no end. Now, here's where it gets truly mind-bending. These cycles aren't just about our physical existence. They carry our mental experiences too. Our brain waves, those delicate ripples of thought and emotion, they don't just disappear into thin air. They radiate out from us, traveling into the vast expanse of the cosmos. These brain waves carrying the echoes of our lives might be the key to explaining deja vu. Imagine, if you will, that these waves from past lives on other planets are reaching us here on Earth. Like cosmic whispers, they brush against our minds, bringing with them echoes of memories, of feelings, of experiences we've lived before, just on a different world. This, my friends, could be the real cause of deja vu. 
Those fleeting moments of recognition, those instances of eerie familiarity, they might just be echoes of our past lives reaching us across the vast expanse of space and time. Like a cosmic radio that only we are attuned, we're picking up this unique frequency from our past selves, living out their lives on past Earths. So, the next time you experience that eerie sense of déjà vu, remember that it may be a sign of our cyclical existence within this time loop. These moments of familiarity, of recognition, they're not just glitches in our minds. They're whispers from our past, echoes of our cyclical existence, signs that we're part of a grand cosmic performance that's been playing out for billions of years across the vast stage of our solar system. Thank you for joining me on this extraordinary journey. If you are a passionate explorer of ancient mysteries and eager to uncover new perspectives, you've come to the right place. Don't miss out on any of my mind-boggling episodes. Hit that subscribe button now and embark on an awe-inspiring voyage of discovery.